Hey everybody, Shane Armand Rowe here. This is an emergency video to restore Battle.net. It's uh, September 16th, 2022. And if you have been running Overwatch or your favorite Battle.net game, launching Battle.net's client through a non-Steam game launcher, then this is for you. Uh, I'm going to assume that you are using my video for installing Battle.net, so uh, if you've used some other methodology, Lutris, whatever, this video may or may not help you other than pointing you in the right direction to maybe making your particular scenario work. Uh, so the way we're gonna get around this is um, you're gonna go to your existing launcher and you're going to go ahead and point to the game executable itself. Now, you're not going to point to the game launcher, but you're going to point to the game executable. So if I were to hit browse, uh, normally this would be putting you in your Blizzard Net folder, right? This is where you would have been launching the Blizzard Net launcher from, right? So you would have been in... Uh, sorry, I'm trying to do this around, around a, uh, a camera here. You probably would have been in Battle.net and you would have been launching the Battle.net browser as per my video. In this case, you're gonna to go to the game you wanna play, find inside the folder, it's probably under like retail, in this case anyway, and then there's overwatch.exe. That's it. Now, well, it's not it, it's step one of two. So now when you actually play the game, uh, it's going to bypass the Battle.net launcher, sort of, it's still going to run in the background, but it's not going to crash. Uh, instead, you're going to unfortunately get dropped to the login screen for Overwatch. Now, typing this on the on-screen keyboard's a real drag, so I'm going to be using my real keyboard. Um, <laughs> make this a little bit easier. I have to look around the camera, make sure I'm typing this right. Boy, I'll tell you, I cannot type it all today. Okay, that looks good. Okay, and there you go. That's it. Yes, you'll have to do this every time. There's no way to pre-populate that. Not that I know of anyway. But you will get back to your game. Uh, I hope this helps out. Uh, special thanks to um, uh, Chronic Game Gee at uh, on Reddit for kind of coming up with this idea and uh, sharing that with us. I hope this helps you out. Um, we'll let you know when we know more or if the problem gets fixed permanently. Thanks for watching.